Well, that's right, baby. Jay Rock is here. It is time for the YouTube People's Champ to do another reaction. We're coming to you live on the corner of Know Your Road Boulevard and Jabroni Drive. And we're about to lay the smack down on another Ace Vein Juneteenth reaction. What a <laughs> Look, it's not that serious. It's, it's just coon. It just, it's just a lot of things. Hi, Lee. Hi. J-Rock. Hands come back. What is happening in 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 with the millions? <laughs> and millions of J-Rock fans from all over the world, baby. J-Rock is here. To, uh, check out this Charlie Black Juneteenth Ace Vane uh, reaction. Man, if you ain't seen the other Ace Vane reactions on the Great Ones channel, go and check them out right now on the People's page. They're up live and ready to go, all right? But come on, baby. Well, let's waste no more time. Let's check this thing out. Morning, class. I'm here to talk to you about Juneteenth. Any of you know what, what Juneteenth is? Wow. Can anybody tell me? Okay. Anybody at all? <clears throat> anybody besides my honky-ass son? How about you right next to him? You look smart. You look like a black film. Well, as of 2021, it will be the latest way for white guilt to be coddled. I don't understand the damn thing you just said. How about you in the front with the Donald Glover here? Who, me? Yeah, you, boy. You look like a young buck that knows his place in history. Oh, I was Martin Luther King birthday. What the goddamn? This is, you don't know what day this represents? You, this is the day your people were freed by great white men. Oh, no. Who Do you know what your ancestors would call you right now if they knew you didn't know your history? Fuck what I know that. Let me write it out for you. See? You be this. Oh, yeah, no, I know this motherfucker. Hey, Frank, leave it. Before your you name. get all upset, I want you to know I'm speaking on behalf of your ancestors when I write that. So it's not racist. I'm about to race up there and put my foot up there, motherfucker. <laughs> Look, it's not that serious. It's, it's just coon. It's just, it's, it's a lot of things named coon, okay? Look, two examples. You got rat, coon, and cuh. Coon. That's not how you spell it. Everything I love shoot your whole shit up tonight. Oh, what's a cuckoo? He's referring to the casing the larva puts itself in to go through metamorphosis. Oh, Morpheus from the Matrix. Right, I know you ain't just called Lawrence Fisher burn a cocoon. No, I did not. Now, I know what a cocoon is. That's when a man have another man come smash his wife in front of him and then the man be in the corner crying but he kind of like it at the same time and be using his tears as lubricant. No, that is called a cuckoo. What the fuck does cuckoo? Hey, get your bitch ass out of here, Franklin. No, man. fuck you little ungrateful ass hoes. Dude, my asshole's not You try right. to do something fucking nice for you people on you, you, you know what, I got something hey, wrong Franklin, with you. You better not come back around this bitch unless you're strapped. <laughs> what the fuck you think he gonna do anything with his own bitch? Go, go, go. Attention students. Due to a recent complaint from a white person, the back to school cookout is now canceled. What? Yeah, that's right. It's canceled. Oh, because oh, running oh, out of pissed off a white guy. Oh, 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 shut, 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 I don't have a human used to that smell. What? You're like pee on yourself all the time or something? No, what? No, I don't pee on myself. But you smell like pee all the time. So what the f? do I do? Like, you ain't know that? Shit. Uh, somebody called you a Waffle House bathroom another day. Who said that? <laughs> Mrs. Shaw. The teacher? Yeah, I said it. Oh, now, nah, remember at the pen rally where the principal said he smelled like a nursing home dumpster? I indubitably did say that shit, and I intend to say more shit, because guess what? Fuck them kids. Oh, God, bro. Oh, oh, you already asked Miss Shaw this. Then you should already know what it is. Fuck them kids. Keep the same energy around this bitch. I ain't getting no fuck. Oh, God. This a clip on top. What? Remember that kid Eric from Special Ed who said we should change his name to FTF? Oh, my God. Yeah, forgot to flush. Oh, shit. Fuck y'all the fuck Eric. Eric passed away last week. I know there's a lot of questions. Like, Lord, why Eric? And why not that boy who smells like marinated urinal cakes? The Eric is what we refer to as special. Some people might even use the word slow, but I don't like to use that word slow because there is no barometer to measure the speed of one's intellectual intelligence in God's kingdom. Eric was on God's time, but now he on that short bus on the way to heaven to take them special classes. Bruh. With Jesus. Look, you out here crying? I'm sorry, I, I thought I, I thought I was by myself. How the fuck? You in a public park? I guess I'm just used to feeling alone. That I I didn't I notice. Know, I only come over here because that's kind of my spot. Right? I, I, I kind of don't fit in. 
and, and, and things like that. I, but I just wanted to be part of the game, you know? And then my dad comes and gets the cookout canceled, and now I'm canceled, you know? Having one friend, one, one freaking friend would really save my mental state and help me a lot. But it just... Hello, bro. I'm, I'm gonna just come out later. Don't don't get no tears all over the wall and shit, cause that's why I like to put my arms up there. Damn, he crying like he on his third step daddy for the month. Nah, he crying like his daddy came back in his life and then left again. Oh yeah, that's that hurt. That's like when your dad said he gonna pick you up on Saturday and he don't never show up, cause he was a hooker. Exactly, oh bitch ass motherfucking daddies, bro. I come down on us, man. I kind of feel bad for Franklin. I think he got a bad rap. You know, right. then the way to help Franklin would to be his friend and help him break the cycle so he doesn't grow up to be Man, an asshole like his dad. Bro, right, she's just saying that shit because she's No, stupid. seriously, someone who would stand by his side in this time of need is someone I would truly admire. <laughs> Y'all smell pee? <laughs> hey, uh, Franklin, I was thinking, uh, if you know, if you needed some some help, I could try to put in a good word for you to get things back to normal. You would do you would do that for me? Um. Yeah. Yes. Yes, I, I would. I would. I would help you. Oh my gosh! I can't believe this. One of the most popular kids in school is, is going to help me. This, oh joy! Ho hold on, I'm, I'm popular, dude. Yes, everybody in school knows you. They, they they say you smell like R. Kelly's bedroom carpet. R. Kelly bedroom carpet smells like pee. So that's what I meant. He smelled like pee, the little boy. And like I said, fuck them kids. But not not the way R. Kelly meant it. Because that motherfucker's just gross, and he going to hell. Me, I just hate children. I love. I, I need to talk to you. Uh, hey, I'm working right now. Get your eyes away from here before they start thinking I'm selling piss for lemonade. What? Bitch, your broke penny from good times. Look, oh, look, I just want you to uncancel Franklin. No, no, no. Damn, I ain't gotta be a difficult bitch about everything. First of all, uncancel ain't even a fucking word. It's not a word. Then how the fuck Second I Second of all, it? you're a goddamn sellout. What the fuck you helping little white boy over here who fucked up my whole back school? It wasn't him. It was dumbass daddy. Who his dumbass son and daddy? Goddamn, you be tripping too hard, bro. He said that little ass ponytail out your fucking head and got your ass stressed Man, out. Man, you are built like a retired detective. And you are dressed like a stunt double in the color purple. was to raise money so we can get new computers for our school, stupid. Oh, say like. Laptops and shit? Yes. So we got computers. We ain't gotta read no more. That's so not how I get the cookout uncanceled. It's not a fucking bitch. Don't fuck I'm eating. Cookout back reinstated. Then I'll reinstate Frank. Cool. Also, it's hot as fuck. Let me get a uh, couple of lemonade real quick. All right, it's, it's $40. $40? The sign said $25. The sign says $25. I don't dollars. explain why you told me $40. The, the lemonade cover, I'm so ashamed. It's my price. It's my motherfucking price. Oh, hell no. I know you ain't bring this lame ass nigga over here. I'm about to bite the shit out of both of y'all. We just need your help. You know you connected in the city, and you can help us. I understand this. all that, but see, the, the thing is, is I don't That's like him. Don't do me like that. I, I don't ever ask you for nothing. Don't bite the hand that feeds you, bro. You ain't fed me in two months. I've been out here getting it out the mud. I'm really but Hold on for a second. Bro, where the fuck is my money? I already told you I'll have it when I have it. You better have that shit right now. Or what? Or your crew about to have a missing person mystery on their motherfucking hands. Did someone mention hands? Because we could get the throwing though. Bro, on God, you better ask your uncle about me, bro. You have to ask my scary ass uncle shit. I handle my own out here. Oh, is that right? Okay, tell me how you gonna handle this. Oh, okay, okay. Nah, go ahead and squeeze that shit, man. Am I supposed to be scared now because you got a pistol? I just spent five days in the kennel. I told you I'll pay your monkey ass when I feel like it. You better suck my dick. Oh. Now how you gonna get your money? So what we need for a cookout? A DJ and, and, and what? Some some tents and some food or some shit? Alright, what's up? You you the DJ? No, nah, I'm just a nigga at the club that play music. So you a DJ? Because that's what a DJ does. Hey, you don't that? fucking know me. Don't try to limit my abilities by putting me in a fucking box. I do a whole plethora of shit. I get tambourine lessons. I coach volleyball. I sell weed. I paint stripes on straws. And I wrote the first script draft to the motherfucking movie. You want a man, motherfucker? Don't put me in a goddamn box. I analyze the fuck out of your finances. I get your ass set up with several bank accounts, have you living off the interest, and change your whole goddamn life. Does that mean I'm a fucking accountant, bitch? I'm, I mean, I saw. Don't put me in a goddamn box. Look, my bad, sir. Nigga, don't call me, sir. My name, DJ. Bro, we just want you to come to the cookout and play fucking music. There's gonna be some hoes there. Huh? I mean, yeah, I guess. Okay, cool. I charge $40 for them services. $40? Nigga, I got that kind of money. That's like eight, five dollar bills. Nigga, my price is my motherfucking price. Look, bro, your black owned business celebration is for black people. Can you find it in the kindness of your heart just to do it one time for your, for your people? 
Nigga, no. Well, fuck you, man. Nigga, Hold fuck on. you. Hey, Charles, don't worry. He just needs to be inspired for the turn up. I call on all of the powers of all of your ancestors. Hit it. Hit it. I'm gonna need $40 on the front and the back end. And this is why nobody likes you. Let me talk my shit. I got a lot of money and I got a long day. You say you got a man, but you pay. I honestly can't believe y'all pulled this off. Honestly, I can't believe that's your only hairstyle. Thanks for frying canceling me, Lakeisha. It's not a word. And, and also, remember, you're on thin fucking ice. Hey, y'all ain't, ain't got no snacks around this bitch? That's a good question. Did, did y'all get anybody to cater? Yeah, that's a great question, because nigga hungry than five lizzos out of salad bar and fat bitches in the... Uh, fuck, fuck the metaphor. I don't, I don't know. I'm hungry, bro. Oh, Franklin said he had that cover. I sure do. One second. Oh, I, I can't even cap. I'm impressed. I'm not impressed. I'm not impressed at all. I'm hungrier than... Two wildebeests and six queen latifas sitting sideways on the man. Fuck the metaphor. I don't know. I'm the hungry as fuck. All right, guys. Chow time. What the fuck? I've lost her little ritzy ass mind. My dad owns uh, produce and catering service, so it, this is perfect. I cannot help you anymore. What? What? What I do? What is going on back there? You told me this was a picnic. This looks like a cookout. Franklin, I'm trying my best here, okay? This was a mistake. I, I don't understand. Dear God, this place is full of non-white people. Is that a sea of blackness over there? That cannot I be said. I'm gonna buy this because it's racially expensive. Um, how speak for yourself? A bitch is hungry. Right, give me two of them motherfuckers right now. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, 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 that I'm the only white man here, I have I'm to take done. responsibility to make sure you all are safe because I, I do believe there's way too many of you here at once, and, and I believe that is a violation in itself. You know, it, it kind of look, it looks kind of sketchy. So I would ask, I would like some of you to leave or, or spread out a little bit. It's, it's just way too, too many at, at once playing loud music. And possibly, I mean, disturbing the peace. Think about the neighbors in, around this area. Hey, well, I'm here, and in, in, in the music's too loud for me. And so you know, so. once again. Okay, who threw a shoe? Who threw a shoe? Is it you? Right there in the blue? Who threw nope, the shoe? This isn't blue, this is turquoise. Look like it was from my it's point of view. I need you all to understand something. I'm on your side. I'm a woke white man. Do you understand how powerful that is? Stop talking over me. I'm still a white man. You will not talk over me as a white man. All right, you guys been way too loud and rowdy. There's only one way to handle this. You got that right. And that is to reach out to the authorities, which you people like to call 12. So just give me a moment while I dial them up. And yeah! I'm not getting to see you. Oh, yeah. some why do you guys look so upset? I don't know. What? 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 You all spend the time to get a spill for so many bitches. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, what J-Rock says this. Ace Vane has done it again. Another hilarious video this brother's put together. He is super, super talented. Super, super funny. If you're not already subscribed to Ace Vane, J-Rock says, go take your candy asses over to his channel, subscribe to him, and tell him that the most electrifying YouTuber in all of YouTube came meant sent you his way to show you love and support because this brother is doing his thing. All right? More Ace Vane videos to come. Again, if you haven't seen the ones already up on my channel, go and check them out right now. Post your comments down below. Let J-Rock know what you thought of his reaction to this video no rhyme intended on that line if you enjoy the great one's reaction hit that like button subscribe and share be sure that you hit that bell so you can be notified when it is time to be electrified thank you for joining j-rock stay tuned for the next video mamba gg and wakanda forever if you smell What J-Rock is cooking.